Hey guys, I just wanted to uh, do a review of the HYD Kip Bar. So I bought my son a Kip Bar. He's been begging me for it. And uh, we were going to build one. And then everything I looked at when I researched it, it just either wasn't strong enough or it didn't seem like it would change with his height. Because he's only eight right now, but he loves gymnastics. He's on the, on the team. And he wants to be able to practice more at home. So we got him that. Now we were looking like a tumble track and all these different ones and they were really expensive. Even buying them like on Craigslist, they were expensive. So we kept searching and finally I found this one. I got it on Amazon, I'll put the link below. It was under $200. Now it's supposed to hold like over 200 pounds. I don't know about that, but we're gonna put it together it looks like it's pretty simple to put together, but here's a good video to kind of show how to get it together because those are the instructions they gave. Basically just a picture. So let's go ahead and get this thing together. Let's see how long it takes us. So the first step is I'm going to go ahead and take this cross support bar and it's actually, they're all separate pieces, so this goes on there and then this is the support that goes on it so it's got a washer on it
gonna line this up and just tighten up the bar. And as you twist it, you'll see the hole that it goes into. Because the thing is already pre drilled. And like I said, since it's loose, I can still do this. If I had tightened up the bottom, I would have had to have made sure I did the bar first. And that's it. So. I'm going to go ahead and take these, they need this little pack of, of, you know, wrenches, disposable wrenches, and I'm going to tighten it all up, and then when my son comes home, we'll go ahead and give it a go.